Um, my name is Kai, and today I decided while I was at the gym that I really wanted to make this video today. Um, I have made several videos on this channel, and not really knowing where I wanted to go when I stopped. But I've been an avid consumer of YouTube probably for the last 10 years. I've loved people like O2L, K&J, I loved Carly Bible, Alana Davison, Jamie Page, and Megan Lynx, and I just love this platform and I just decided that I really wanted to film video just kind of doing what I've always wanted to do but what I've been up too afraid to do. Um, so today I am going to just kind of talk about what I want to do on this channel while trying to do what I consider my makeup or any situation. I don't wear makeup every day of my life, um, but when I do, this is what I do and it's um, pretty simple. I pretty, I'll just kind of just go through it as I talk about what I really want to do with this channel. Um, I really love this platform and I just I just said that all but I don't know I just there's something about the fact that people are just able to create and something so instant also it's like I am an avid reader of books and I love film and TV I just love stories being told and the fact that people are just able to tell their story every day on this platform is pretty it's pretty crazy to me um my mirror is back there, so I have another mirror right here, but that one I can see my full face in. But, um, so this channel has gone from me talking about running, has gone from me talking about being tall. Um, I think it's gonna, that's all gonna end up being about those things, but more. Um, I am turning 22 in less than a month. I just, not as scary as I thought it was going to be. I don't know. Getting older has never really freaked me out in the sense of like the fact that I'm getting old. Go <laughs> up 22. I'm going to be 22. It sounds absolutely ridiculous. But I don't know. It's just, I'm not in the place that I thought I would be at 22. Um, like living at home, going to junior college still, um, not quite knowing what I want to do career wise. Well, knowing what I want to do, but being too afraid to go for it. I want to be a writer, and being a writer is... It's hard, not just because even good writers, there's good writers out there that haven't made it. It's So it's like, you could be good at something and still not make it. You could be great at something and still not make it. Um, so, like, there's that fear, but there's also the fear of, like, not being able to finish anything that I start because I've started several stories and I don't know where they're completely going all the time. Um, a lot of the stories that I write are not about me but they're about people that I see that I haven't necessarily seen their or read their story before and I consume so much stories. I read and I I just love characters and I love character development and I just, there's so many people out in this world that I just haven't seen a story about them and that's what I want to create. I want to write stories about people that I haven't seen stories perpetuating, I guess. Um, I don't know if that's the right word right now. I am. Um, so I just put some concealer on. Um, I, I don't even always do that, but sometimes. I just want some brightness or like some stuff under my eyes just because sometimes I get a little dark and I don't sleep because you know if you're a writer then you know that sometimes writing hits you at like 10 o'clock at night and then you'll start and you continue writing and you realize that it is 4 o'clock in the morning and that your day starts the next day and you do not have time for sleep or you have time for sleep but you can't sleep any longer than two, three hours. Um, so I probably will talk about being tall. Um, I am six foot two, which to the average is very tall, but on the tall spectrum of women, 
I am probably towards the middle. Um, I consider myself tall, and most of my friends consider myself tall. I'm taller than my older sister, and I am a little bit shorter than my younger brother. Um, I used to hate being tall, and as like much as I have become confident in my height, I still have those moments where my height, I get a little self-conscious over it. Um, and it's like over the stupid reasons, like if a guy looks at me a certain way, and I'm just like, I'm taller than him, he's never going to see me the same way as he sees other girls just because I'm taller than him and there's like this, there's just like this boundary around girls being taller than guys. I, if I do that I'm just checking to make sure that the camera's still recording because I, this is like, you know, I'm like doing a makeup video, make makeup video and I really don't want to start and wipe off my face. Not that I'm doing that much anyways. Um, I'm a pretty natural brow person. I fill in the sparse areas and then I brush them all up so they kind of all look uniform. Um, I don't always put eyeshadow on but when I do it's usually not even like the normal people eyeshadow like neutral colors. I have this blush. Um, called Mellow Wine and I think it's super pretty. And then I have this other blush called Golden Set and Set. I think it's from Makeup Geek, but I'm not sure. Probably isn't. I'm probably completely wrong about that, so don't take me for my word on that. But I don't know, I just like peaches and the pinks on my eyes. I just think that they I don't know. I just like how they look. Um what was I talking about? Oh, not being tall. Um I do consider myself tall and a lot of people do. I'm I'm way above the average in the United States, I'm above the average pretty much everywhere, I think. Um, I have some pretty interesting stories about people and their reactions to being tall and, and just being tall in the world where, I don't know, it's just like people are very odd about the way that they react to me. Um, I work in a restaurant, so I deal with people and customer service every day, and there's not much you can say when people are odd or rude or say just like peculiar things about being tall. Like, I don't really think people think about what they're saying before they say it to me. They're just like, oh my gosh, you're so tall, and how often do you love the obvious being stated to you in any shape or form? For me, I don't love it. But I've gotten really used to it and my mom, my mom is the most mama bear person in the world so I'm, I'm out with her and someone says something, she just wants to like get them away or to like go off and I'm just like, you know, people are people and people will continue just doing the same things because people are creatures of habit and people see something that's not normal to what they normally see and they're going to comment on it. Or they're going to stare. Which, I don't know which is better. Staring or commenting and not staring. I don't know if you can hear the air conditioning. It just turned on. And I don't feel it. Okay, I feel it now. But, um, that's pretty much all I'm going to do for my eyes. I might just bring some under. Why well, I just stopped filming, but it stopped filming. But oh, we're back. We are back and back in action. I'm just putting mascara on. This is Total Temptation. I think it's Maybelline. Yeah, probably Maybelline. I, I don't know, but I think it's Maybelline. But um, and a marathon is something that I've always wanted to do, but I don't know. I am like, I'm disciplined about certain things and other things I'm not. Like if you were able to see around, my room is an absolute mess right now, and I think that has a lot to do with the fact that I have a lot of stuff that I don't wear and. That's what fills my drawer. I can't really think about anything other than running when I'm running. Which for me, it's like, it's a break from my brain. Because I don't think I stop thinking at any point in my life. I, I think, and I think, and I think, and I think. And sometimes I feel like I don't know what I'm thinking about. Sometimes my brain lipstick a lot. Especially at work, because it feels like icy feel. I don't know, I just like how it looks. And but if I'm not wearing red lipstick, I'm not wearing any lipstick. So, 
This is just Vaseline Lip Therapy. I have gotten up several times during this video, and I kind of don't really know what I'm doing. All I know is that I want to create content or whatever just because I love watching content and so I want to see if I can actually create the thing that I love so much. I spent a lot of time with my siblings and we did a bunch of goofy stuff and me and my sister started a podcast when we were like, I don't even know what we were doing, but we were like, I was like eight or nine and we talked about the Jonas Brothers and that's not what I might want to do. I might want to talk about movies or books or... I'm going to talk about stories that I'm writing or something that I listen to on the radio. What did I love listen to the radio on? I said that I listen to Spotify on the radio for days of my life. Um, or a podcast. Or just talking about life. That's what I want this channel to be. Life. This might just be me talking about my life or my siblings or someone that I met or a podcast that I listen to or something that I heard on Spotify or, or an old song or a TV show. This is a real world, especially a real world to live in. In 2019. If you want to follow my channel, please subscribe. Thanks. Bye.